Here's the rain barrel overflow valve, and so you can attach a hose and have that run to another rain barrel next to it, so it can fill up the second one, or it can go down to your soaker hose. Um, and then uh, down at the bottom, you got your drain valve, and over here, you can attach your hose to the spigot. And um, also, uh, this rain barrel is not um, on top of one, but you really usually want to have it on top of some kind of um, bricks or cinder blocks or something to get it about a foot or more off the ground so that you have a little water pressure even when the water is low in your rain barrel. Um, now this one isn't lined up right but the water really should be shooting a little bit more towards that grate. And this grate needs to be um, cleaned uh, if it gets all filled and you can take the top off and undo this um, kind of, I don't know what you call that, but you can take the top off and um, clean it out. Um, and inside, I don't know if you can see inside, but there is mosquito netting in there. Oh, can't see it. Um, so the mosquito netting sometimes can get clogged. Um, that way mosquitoes can't get in to lay eggs. There's also mosquito netting blocking um, the outflow from the overflow valve, and that makes the overflow valve get clogged sometimes, but then it just overflows on the top anyway, so that's fine. Thank you. 